and welcome back to another video in another bathroom but this time the bathroom is mine yes we moved into our new place uh, about three weeks ago yeah we've been in here about three weeks so we're still getting settled in i'm gonna find somewhere um out there that i can film i want to come back real quick because i haven't been back in a while yeah i did some more twists i think Cynically's twists are becoming my favorite go-to style. Um, I did have my hair down briefly after I took out a set of my twists. I washed, conditioned, and did some more stuff to my hair. And then, um, yeah. So, I'm no longer natural. I relax my hair. That's the something else I did to my hair. I relax my hair. You ever do something and regret it like almost immediately? Yeah. So I relaxed my hair and then after I relaxed my hair, I was like, why did I do that? Then I started to buzz it off and I was like, no, nah, don't do that. So I don't know what I'm going to do with my hair at this point. I don't know if I'm going to continue relaxing it, which I don't know because it's, it's relaxed. Um, I have about this much new growth at this time. I relaxed it about a month and a half ago. Yeah. And you see it's back in single, single least twist. So I don't know what the what the point of me rela oh, I was tired of fighting fairy knots. That was the point of me relaxing my hair because I was having to cut my hair a lot because of the fairy knots. I have low porosity hair. Um, I was fighting to get moisture in because of the lack of moisture. I was um, have I was attracting a lot of fairy knots, which was getting on my nerves. So. I have been relaxed before and my hair did fairly well so I was like you know what I'm just gonna relax it and then after I relaxed I was like why did I do that I should have just kept breaking it up so yeah I am relaxed at this point and I put a clip in what my hair looks like I text likes my hair because I got tired of fighting the fairy knots so I did kind of relax it but you ever did something regret it that's a clip from my vlog channel. Y'all got to go over there and follow me. Keeping up with Des. If y'all want to see what this apartment looks like. Because I did an apartment tour. Um, yeah. Keeping up with Des. Go over there and check me out. I put my hair back up in these twists. I actually finished the last braid this morning. I'm working from home. And I fin was finishing up my hair while I was actually working. I was so happy to be finished. It took me like three days to do this. Uh, let me take it down because... I mean, and it is super long. I don't think I've ever braided my hair this long. Look how long this is. Yeah, this is really long. Let me take it down so y'all can see. And it's a lot of braids. Oof. Yeah, let's take one loose. All right, so I'm gonna put this back in and I'm gonna show you the hair. I've never used this hair before. And the actual hair is like an ocean wave and it's kind of light. And I got the hair one because of the color and two because it was pre-feathered. So again, I start off as a braid. As you can see, come down here. I start off as a braid. After braiding down a little bit, and then incorporate the third piece with the other two and then I just start twisting down. Don't mind my nails. I'm not going into a nail salon. I actually bought some stuff to learn to do my own nails and I am going to do my nails now. My hair is dying. Um, I'm not comfortable going into a nail salon just yet um, with everything that's going on you guys know. And I hope everybody is doing well out there in this pandemic. It's Something I never thought I would see in my lifetime and wish that none of us would have to witness or experience in our lifetime or ever. But anyway, um, so stay safe, guys. Let me show you how the hair that I use. I actually bought four packs. I used three full packs and then I went into the fourth pack. So this is the hair. It's the Bobby Boss King pre feather Tip Ocean Wave 28 Inches. And it has three bundles per pack. Like this is a bundle right here. Let me show y'all what the 
what the ends look like. So after braiding the hair, this is what the ends look like. And I like the ocean wave at the back. Oh, I didn't show y'all actually how long the hair was after I took it down. Y'all look at this. And I am five foot four, so this is a lot of hair for my little frame or my compact frame. Yeah. I actually love it. So I'm probably gonna leave this in for the next four months. And the only reason I leave my Senegalese twist in that long, I don't recommend leaving your hair in that long at all, but because I know how to maintain them and redo them. So even though I leave them in a total of four months, I go throughout periodically and redo them and freshen up so they're not um, dreading at the root. Um, when I'm freshening them up, I make sure I remove any shedded hair so my hair won't lock. That's that's important. That's why it's not. That's why it's important not to leave your hair in um, more than two months if you don't know how to retouch your own hair because your hair sheds every day. And when they're in braids or any type of protective style, even so ends. The shed of hair has nowhere to go. So if you leave it in too long, your hair will lock. It will mat up because the shed of hair has nowhere to go. Anyway, that is my hair update. Um, like I said, if y'all want to know what I've been doing, go over to Keeping Up With Dares. I'm going to put the link below. Y'all check me out. I do all kinds of stuff over there. As I finish braiding this down, I will talk to you guys later. Um... Go over to Keeping Up With Dads. See what I've been up to. You know, you'll find out what's going on in my life. Because I'm pretty much an open book. I'm not afraid of my journey. It makes me stronger. It's made me stronger. It's, it's, my journey has given me insight to strengths I did not know I had. Um, meaning, like, patience. Now, my faith has always been there, but patience, um, I learned patience. Uh, I learned I had patience. I gained patience, and I always had faith. So, anyway, I will talk to you guys later to the next video. Bye, guys.